Hey guys, it's Jana, and it is time to take down Christmas. Most of the time I do it right after New Year's, but we waited a little bit this time. There is a tradition that some people do leave their Christmas tree up until January 6th. So that is the end of the 12 days of Christmas. Ah, I decided to enjoy my Christmas decorations a little bit longer. So be sure to let me know when you guys actually take down your Christmas decorations. Some people do it the day after Christmas, some people do it the day after New Year's, and some people just enjoy it a little bit longer and leave it until January 6th. So here we are. We are gonna take everything down and de the house. So if you haven't done it already, I hope this motivates you to get it all done, get your house back to its normal state and say goodbye to Christmas one more time until next year. I just love having the house decorated. It's just so happy. So go ahead and hit subscribe, thumbs up, check all the links down below. Be sure to share this video with all of your friends. Let's take out Christmas today. Hmm, kind of sad. So as I collect the Christmas things, I just take them over onto the pool table. You know, that pool table gets more use just being storage than actually playing pool, but Oh well, I just didn't want a second living room, to be honest. Everything out of the entertainment center. Done, done, done. And on to the bathroom. There's just a few things and then a little bit in the hall. And all of our nice fluffy stuffy stuff. And yes, I still need to clean up the kitchen, but oh well, we'll do it as we go along. too short for this one. I had to crawl up onto the counter. I did not want to fall and I didn't. Yay! I have so many service trays and I just gotta put them all back in their boxes. I think it's smart to keep all the packaging for any of your platters, just to keep it safe when you package it away, you don't have to worry about it breaking. Not get this off so I'm gonna use the tools around me yep the snowman that'll work and with my little village I like to get all the little stuffing out first and put it in a little plastic bag and then we scoop up all of the pieces and they're just plastic toys they are not fragile so I just wrap them up in this sheet because I'm going to need the sheet next year. I'm just going to have to iron it. It works out pretty well. I asked Emma to go upstairs and collect any Christmas things, so she's running up there and helping me out while I pack everything away. Look at all this stuff. I just love Christmas.
like playing a game of Tetris, trying to get everything in the boxes. I'm trying to downsize as much as I can, but you know what? I really love a lot of this stuff. I package up all the soft stuff in trash bags just because it's easier and they take up so much room. If I would put them in the bins, it would be ridiculous. So it keeps them safe from dirt in the garage throughout the year. thing is the tree and I don't know why I am like this but I keep all the packaging for the ornaments also because it's just the perfect container for them and I have to keep the colors together for whatever weird reason so I'm gonna do the red and then I'll do the silver and then I'll do another red I don't I don't know I don't know why I do it that way I always have it's just my way I suppose <laughs> and round we go to get the lights off. When I'm taking them off, I like to wrap them around my arm. And yes, it got stuck in my hair, but then I wrap the wire around itself and then plug it into itself. And it perfectly holds together while it is stored for the year. Bye bye Christmas tree, you served me well. And on to the ornaments. I gotta package these all away and find all the correct boxes and all of that stuff and put them in this tote. I have all of the tree stuff in one tote, which makes it really easy when next year comes along. I just know this one tote is all tree.
now I'm exhausted. All right guys, that's it. Christmas is over, officially. <laughs> so we got our bear Christmas tree. I'll leave that for hubby. He will take it out tomorrow to go get recycled and then I will leave all of the boxes out there also for hubby so he can put them back in the garage. But yeah, everything is put away. Whew, that was a bigger job than I thought it was gonna be. Well, at least it took longer than I thought it would. I gotta make some dinner, I'm starving. So are the kids. So I hope this motivated you to get your Christmas taken away and put away for the year. Who will be motivated by that? I know. Your face is just pressing, no one will do that. <laughs> So thank you so much for watching. Go ahead and hit subscribe, thumbs up. Check all the links down below. Be sure to check out those videos I picked out just for you. And I will see you next time.